<laughs> you are beautiful, and I'm gonna cover you up with a towel so that you don't hurt me or see me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Got my gloves. Wow. So, I've got a hood on it. That way I can't see anything and it's a lot calmer. I wrapped its feet up because those are what I'm worried about mostly. But yeah, look at the gorgeous colors on this one. It's a lot lighter. So on a new bird, you want to just kind of give it a good inspection. Just make sure there's nothing major that, that you can see. Um, one of the bigger things you want to do is you want to feel it's called the keel. So right here is their, um, what's it called? Crop. That's where they store their food. So if it was really full, it would have like a big bump right there. It doesn't seem super full. Almost a little hungry probably. And the keel, so the, the word for when it's super sh uh, pointy is like sharp. Um, it's, it's a little bit sharp, but not really. It, it feels pretty good, like it's not starving. Um, so it's, it's been getting some stuff. Um, but yeah, this is a good looking bird. And ironically, that there is the Gunnison prison. <laughs> so I'm thinking I'm gonna have to come up with some sort of prison related name. I think it's a female. It's a pretty good size. Uh, males would be a little bit smaller. So, and then, so there was another one that I was um, looking at, but if you notice here, the tail is not red. They're called a red-tailed hawk, but the tail only becomes red after their first year. So this is a juvenile because it's not a red tail. It's got the brown kind of barred look. And there's all sorts of variations. This one's a bit normal coloring. Um, there's some that are my bird last year was a lot darker But yeah, they're just gorgeous Anyway, if you can think of a prison themed name <laughs> That's maybe a girl name Let me know We are home <laughs> She hates my guts right now oh, I know yeah, you're scared, huh? So she pretty much thinks I'm going to want to eat her. So she gets all big and puffy, saying, stay away, don't mess with me. She is big. She's 1,400 grams or so, maybe a little less. She's got some really good feet. Giant talons. So the next few days are called manning, basically getting her used to me, calming her down, letting her know I'm not going to kill her. You kind of starve them a little bit, but they kind of do that to themselves because they don't really want to take food from you. So eventually you kind of have to force feed them, but you get them kind of hungry to the point where you start feeding them and then they learn pretty quick. So anyway. Oh yeah, look at you, you are so big.